everyone, welcome Adam to the Mari Show. Adam, Adam has come here, hopefully, to put a 29-year-old mystery to rest. He believes in his heart that a man named Kenny could be his biological father. But Kenny is convinced that Adam's real dad is a deceased African-American man named Tyrone. <laughs> Ten years ago, Adam's mother, Martha, passed away, leaving Adam with not only memories of a painful childhood, but with the last known lead in his search for his biological father. This is his story. My life was filled with nothing but pain and turmoil. My mother was a drug addict and ran the streets. Her addiction was so bad that she sold our Christmas presents for drugs. It was horrible. I was always told that my mother's husband, Tyrone, was my birth father. He was a terrible man. He did horrible things to me and my family. When I was eight years old, my mom dropped a bombshell. She told me that a man named Kenny was my biological father and he had six daughters. This gave me hope and I knew I wanted to find my biological father one day. When I was 18 and my mom died, I tracked Kenny down on Facebook. But today I am angry and pissed off because this man denies that I am his son. Kenny has six daughters that he cares for and he denies me his only son. It is BS. I am tired of being a black sheep with a family, and today I want to prove these DNA results. You're angry with him. Yes. Why? I'm angry with him because he denied me my entire life. He has six daughters that he took under his wing and never denied any of them. And I'm his only son, and he denies me. And I'm tired of it. I went through different foster homes being denied as a child. I got adopted. My adopted family even denies me, like, treats me bad. It's just to the point of my life where I want to get over it to find who my real family is. Okay. It's not about money, it's about support. Your childhood was a nightmare. Yes. Your mother was a drug addict. The man who you thought was your father abused you. And then you were put in foster care. Yes, Maury. Yeah. I was eight years old when I went to my first foster home. I found out when I was eight years old that Kenny might be my father. Look at us. You look nothing like me. I do look like you need your eyes checked. All my daughters look alike and you look like none of them. All right, well, get glasses. <laughs> Here he is, Kenny. Kenny, let's get this straight before we do anything. Look at him. Does he look African-American to you? I have 20 grandchildren. Half of them have ha African-American fathers, and they are just as white as he is. Oh, my yes. Lord. You still think he, so, it, the African-American could be his father? I do. I still do think this. Yes, I do. Because I'm not his father. If you're not my father, why you used to give my mother money and try to... You party train Because your mother too. was a drug addict, and okay, I was trying to help her out. You party train random people. You remember me party training? You even told me that you helped party train me. You are delusional. Kenny, let's talk about the fact that you have six daughters, right? I had six daughters I, from ages from 37 to 21 with one woman. I was with this woman for 32 years. Do you think that one of the reasons why you don't want to accept Adam is because you would have had to admit to your then wife that you cheated on her? Exactly. No, yeah. hell no. Yeah. Hell no, because this thing... This did not happen until two weeks after my wife passed away. And then Adam surfaced. Two weeks later, then he surfaced. The DNA don't lie, man. Yeah. Oh, I know. Yeah. We're gonna find out right now, okay? Yeah. Thank you. And by the way, Ken, if he is your... If he is your child, will you welcome him into the family? No, he's destroyed my family. What? He's destroyed my family. He went to my daughter's... He went to my daughter's before he went to me. Like, letting my daughters think I was cheating on my wife. I have six daughters, half of you them still don't on speak to me today. I'm the third oldest one. I was se I'm the third we oldest out of all your children. We were separated for three months when I went with your mother, well, and that was on a drunk. It, I was it's, drunk in and the I case a place of 29 year old Adam. What? Kenny. 
You are the father. Somebody kill me. Ladies and gentlemen, kill me. You owe me an apology, Murray. You're not going to apologize to us. You better open your heart to this boy. Murray. I will. Thank you. I will. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Murray. Adam. You are not the father. <laughs>